guys welcome back to life updates with t thank you so much for tuning in and thank you so much for joining me if you are new to this channel we are the winning family the moving train and if you would like to be a part or be a member of this family make sure that you hit the subscribe button and also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you know whenever we get to post a new video so guys i am back with another update who go tricky in the streets okay so vino basically is being dragged you know for treating what he treated using his own hands using his own phone as well as his own data okay so yesterday vino tweeted something um and then people didn't really take it right okay he said making making good money in silence is the best i think this was just the beginning of everything this is when this is after everything started unfolding and it went crazy people were like wait <laughs> making money in silence no please don't play with us you know you know how people are you know how people are like when it comes to negativity as South no, let me not say south africans as people we go number one we take the first position and this one replied and said then make the music and play to yourself and your family members no need to put it out there for silence sake <laughs> and then this one replied and he said he is making money in silent but here in silence but here telling us hi bo Yo, guys, it got to a point where Ghost Nation um, fans also got dragged to this whole entire mess. But it's okay, we'll get to that. We'll get to that. Let's just continue. And this one said, I remember when you said you make millions in a week, Wena. And this one replied and said, behave. I also remember that. Yeah, I also remember when Vino was actually, you know, telling them, uh, inside the house that he makes you know millions within just within we a week or within weeks you know i do remember this conversation yeah i actually do remember the conversation so the fact that people still remember this and they thought of reminding him about this is just so crazy that's just one thing about it and then this one said umaga when uh, making money in silence you just want to deceive us Thinking that you're making money, but you don't want to show it. Hmm, is that possible? <laughs> and then Vino came back again and he said, Okay, why are some people pressed by me working hard? I'm lost, so I must slow down for everyone to be happy. But anyway, God bless, lol. The Twitter streets, jer, a, a hectic, jer. And then... He later on said, as chilled as I am, I, I am human too. I'm not going to allow being bullied into anything, not on Twitter or anyway. If you genuinely like me and want to see me succeed, let's keep going. I'll do all I can to make you proud by working harder. Okay, Mr. Miller. All right. And then this one said, um, your first mistake was boasting about being the most book host in SA right now. People take it in their own way, so you must be ready for different responses. Well, true. Just remember, Black Coffee is a Grammy Award winner, but never boast about his gigs. You need to chill now. Is this true, though? Okay, let's move on, guys. Like, and then this one said, why do you care so much about what people think of you? Be yourself. Live your life. You weren't born to please anyone. People will always be negative to anything you do, whether it's bad or good. Be yourself, Vino. Do you? Which I actually think it's true. Like everyone should just do themselves. Everyone should just do what's best for them. And then this one as well said, Vino, don't mind those people. They are bitter with their own lives and projecting on you. Oxalayo, no one will dim your light, even if they can practice witch witchcraft. God will deal with their evil hearts. So, um, I really honestly think Vino shouldn't take this personal, you know. I mean, obviously, like, being a public figure is not an easy job. It's not an easy thing. Whatever you put out there, people are going to respond. 
and most comments are gonna be negative you know they're gonna be negative and also i feel like he shouldn't have tweeted that thing of saying that making money in silence um is the best because with him he's a public figure who actually works like publicly he hosts he um does events he um for instance like he's been telling us that he's gonna be on tv you know so honestly i don't think that was um a great move from him even though i don't think he's he deserved all the bullying and all the negativity that came his way but at the same time i feel like no he shouldn't have, he shouldn't have done that you know if like he was someone who's a businessman working behind the scene behind the scenes and we don't get to see anything from them we don't get to know any announcement from them i feel like it would have made sense more you know i'm not sure if you guys do get what i'm saying but yeah it is what it is um yeah i think you shouldn't take it personal at the end of the day we all know that negativity is there if there's nothing negative in your life then there's definitely something wrong that you're doing because neg negative comments and negative people are just always there and will forever be there so yeah guys let's just move on to the next and we have Nale over here. So Nale yesterday was actually invited in the Disney Plus launch. So she went there to attend. You know, I saw her with public figures. I saw Michelle posted her on her stories and stuff like that. So I'm really happy for her. You know, like she is really, you know, attending nice events. Hey, I saw I even saw well to be here this moment. She's just always, you know, attending those nice, nice events. So a lot of people were a bit negative about her look. You know, I really think Nali is a beautiful lady, guys. And when it comes to style me, I feel like we we all different we all prefer different stuff we all prefer different things i honestly don't think this look is bad like according to me i honestly don't think it's bad i just feel like okay because like you can see that it's just a normal nice dress maybe if it was like in a different color it would have been more nicer but i don't really think the look is bad you know like the way people have been saying it and have been putting out there but anyways, guys, just tell me what you think about what I just spoke about today uh, regarding the vinyl issue and stuff like that. As well as Nale, you know, um, make sure that you comment, like, and subscribe. I think I'm just going to end my video here. So thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys again when I come back with another video. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell, your notification bell, so you know whenever I get to post a new video. Bye.